I see a lot of people talking about Shmir Sanayim, how to make sure that our eyes don't see what we shouldn't see and all that. And they all have different techniques, doing 18 jumping jacks, saying five kapitlach to Helen when they are in this urge of watching something which they shouldn't. Or they should get a filter on their phone and all the different techniques. But that's all good, but only temporarily. But it's not dealing with a problem. It's called running away from reality. There is a problem and we got to deal with it. When I got a cut a few months ago on my finger, which it still has a scar, but when I got this deep, deep cut, me putting a band-aid won't help it to heal. It won't do anything besides making sure that there's no uh, outside germs going into my body. So putting a filter on a phone is the same thing as a band-aid, but it's still not taking care of the problem. I've seen people saying you should do jumping jacks when you have the urge to watch something or see something immoral. Well, jumping jacks is just like taking supplements, taking pills to ease the pain. But it doesn't deal and help the problem. Saying five kapitlach to Hillam is a beautiful thing, but it won't go back to the actual problem. There's a problem that a person has and they run away from their regular day-to-day -day happiness to find other happiness, which that will bring them happiness for the moment or for the day. But it, putting a filter is a beautiful thing, but it doesn't help the problem. A person can have 15 filters on his phone, but when he has the urge, he's going to find a different way how to deal to fulfill his need. So we're still not dealing with the actual problem. Dealing with the actual problem, meaning to say, making sure that we shouldn't get to the point of the urge, we have to fulfill our whole, our emptiness, with some type of, different type of kosher happiness. If someone enjoys playing music, let him play music, which will fulfill his happiness. And usually, when a person has this crazy urge to run for bad, is because something is bothering him. He's embarrassed, he's hurt, whatever it is. So the problem is not that he has or doesn't have a filter. It's like he does or doesn't have a band-aid. Me doing jumping jacks when I have this huge big cut will take away the pain. I'll forget about the pain for the moment. But the pain is still there. I have to get stitches, get the right treatment to make sure it heals the right way. The right treatment is not having a filter. A filter is beautiful, but doesn't help the source of the problem. The roots of the problem is that something is bothering the person. And when something is bothered by the person, they try to fulfill it with something which will make them happy. And the easiest instant happiness is to go to immoral things. So the point is not, and again the point is not, to get a filter. The point is not to do this jumping jacks and say five kapitel of the helm and all the other counting sheeps and all that. That's beautiful for the moment, but it's not dealing with the actual problem. For the moment you can do whatever you want. But to deal with the actual problem is to find true happiness within ourselves. That we don't have to run to different happinesses. And yes, there is a Yetzirah. And for the Yetzirah, the band-aid is enough. For the Yetzirah, you can do some jumping jacks. But unfortunately, we're way worse than just the Yetzirah. We're way further than just the Yetzirah. If we would have been just the Yetzirah, then we'll have a filter and that's good enough. That will protect us to get to the first point. But some of us are holding so much further than just the first point. So we have to find something which could fulfill our true happiness. And with that, we won't have to get to the point of making the jumping jacks all day and running away from reality and running away from the problem. Let's deal with the problem the way you're supposed to. And then we won't get to the point of having more problems one on top of the next. Now again, even with the filter, even with doing the right things, we will still have a scar in our, on, on our finger. I got a cut. I did it the right way. I still have a, a mark on it, a scar. Yes, it's true. But we still have to deal with it the right way in order to do the best and make the best out of what we have. Have a great night, guys.